Yes, but I will. Yes, find Ivo, please. What is happening? What is this? What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Ben and today I'll be reacting to the final of Avatar The Last Airbender. Now I am not ready for this show to end. It only just feels like Zuko joined the group and now it's already coming to a close. So I know I'm not going to be ready for whatever this one does, but I am really excited just to just see what they do. They've knocked it out of the park with all the finals that they've done before, nor the more to try. Barsing say all of them have been amazing, so I cannot wait to see what they actually do with the Fire Nation now that we're in it and how this show actually finished. There's four whole episodes all in one and I cannot wait to see what they do. After the last episode, I'm really not sure what to expect. It was a fun, wacky, just recap of everything, going to the, like a theater and just getting to see the Fire Nation's interpretation of what the ending will be. I'll be interested to see if it lines up with what this ends up being. But yeah, with everything this show has done, I cannot wait to see how it all comes to a close. I think the main thing I'm hoping for is just a reunion with Zuko and Iroh because they um, only saw each other last during the invasion. No, they, kind of, they missed each other. Well, Zuko missed him. So I need them to be reunited and for peace to be made there. And I think the biggest thing I'm looking at as well is what was left off after Katara's episode with Aang having to come to terms with he has to take the Fire Lord's life. So that is going to be really interesting to see how they overcome that. And it's in the final, it's like this last bit of character development for Aang. It's right caught up in all of the ending stuff. So I can't wait to see how they do that. But yeah, as always, if you do enjoy this video, please remember to like, subscribe, as it really does help the channel to grow. And if you do enjoy my content and you want to help support the channel, I do have a Patreon link will be in the description. Over there, I'm uploading these videos and the full reaction a week in advance. So if that's something you're interested in, feel free to check it out. With that said, let's just dive on in. More ferocious. Imagine striking through your opponent's heart. Still looks so miserable. Now let me hear you roar like a tiger dillo. That sounded pathetic. <laughs> Why does he want him to be angry when he's firebending? Is it angry or is it trying to be intimidated? Powerful maybe? Cool glass of watermelon juice. Ooh, ooh, me, me, me! Hey, your lesson's not over yet. Okay, we're in with the goofiness, cool. Sitting around the house has made us pretty lazy. But I know just the thing to change that. Beach party! Okay, so far, I, yeah, I'm, I'm just thinking, like, I was didn't know if this was going to be a very super serious final, but it feels like the... So far, it's funny. It still has time to get serious. I like the wackiness. I feel like it's capturing the goofy side of Avatar like it always has been. I'm hoping it does get serious though. <laughs> Check out my office sand sculpture. That is awesome. But I've been working on my sand bending. Really? You're gonna love this. Okay, so she can earth bend, matter bend, and sand bend now. How is she not like, she's her own little avatar. Like an earth avatar. Blubbering blob monster? What is that? No, it's Suki. That's insulting. We'll all understand if you break up with them over this. I think it's sweet. Oh, I do love that couple. They're great. Oh, great. Why? Okay, just trying to destroy all the fun. Not the. Oh, that was art. No, don't blow up Appa, please. What are you doing? Teaching you a lesson. No, oh, what is he doing? Okay, back. Okay, this feels like the serious stuff I wanted, but no. It's like some weird training thing. What are you doing? He just he was just grumpy before. Why is he doing this? I'm crazy. I made a sand sculpture of Suki, and he destroyed <laughs> He's still it. trying to put it back together. Oh, and he's attacking me. <laughs> <laughs> I love how Suki was dragging him away as well. Okay, this kind of it's not like him being evil. He's not gone crazy. He's just doing something for some weird reason. It's not. I. They wouldn't make him go stupid right at the end. He's been through too much. A grip before he blasts you off this roof. Go ahead and do it. What's he, he's, I'm guessing he's just trying to make Ang be a bit more powerful from what the firebending practice we've been shown now. Still not firebending though. He's just doing other th stuff. He's not trying to fight. Oh, whoa, okay, I love the five. Five has gotten so much more cool. There's a whole corridor of flames. Enough. Oh, that looked cool. Oh. oh, wow, you just blast him out the house. Wow. How can you sit around having beach parties when Sozin's Comet is only three days away? Oh, it's three days. That's a very short amount of time. About Sozin's Comet, I was actually going to wait to fight the Fire Lord until after it came. What? That's what? The deadline was very specific. You all knew Aang was going to wait? Honestly, if Aang tries to fight the Fire Lord right now, he's going to lose. What does that mean, though? I thought that, like, it, the, with the Fire Nation, whatever, the, the Comet would win the war. But they pretty much won the war when they took Ba Sing Se. Things can't get any worse. Oh, wait, so they've actually already won? My father asked me to attend an important war meeting. 
It was what I dreamed about and wanted for so many years. Back to this. If there's important information here, why did you not share it sooner? Earthbender rebellions have prevented us from achieving total victory in the Earth Kingdom. What is your recommendation? I love how calm the Fire Lord is. He's not like just destroy, he's actually letting people think. He's not like so domineering. He's such a weird, cool villain. Prince Zuko, you've been among the Earth Kingdom commoners. Do you think that adding more troops will stop these rebellions? Actually asking for advice. They can endure anything as long as they have hope. Yes, you're right. He's gonna twist it. We need to destroy their hope. There we go, he used Zuko's experiences. I think you should take their precious hope and the rest of their land and burn it all to the ground. Of course, great. Two peas in the pod. Sozin's comet is almost upon us. Will endow us with the strength and power of a hundred sun. What? No, Bender will stand a chance against us. You gotta be kidding. I thought they got stronger, but not that stronger. Now. I will use its power to end the Earth Kingdom. Oh wow! It's actually gonna just go and destroy the biggest continent? Not the uh, country? A fire that will destroy everything. And out of the ashes, a this new imagery. will be born. In his shadow just over the Earth Kingdom. I am the supreme ruler of everything. Oh dear, there we go. There's big villain goal. My whole life I struggled to gain my father's love and acceptance. But once I had it, I realized I lost myself getting there. No, it's beautiful. You made it. But that would have been really useful if you told it earlier. I always knew the Fire Lord was a bad guy, but his plan is just pure evil. Yeah, so that means Toph's parents would get caught up in that, right? So what I want some... This would be the perfect time to do some more with that. Don't defeat the Fire Lord before the comet comes. There won't be a world to save anymore. Yeah, it'll be done. You'll have no Earthbenders, and all that'll be left is the Southern Water Tribe, which has no Waterbenders, and the Northern Water Tribe, which will be wiped out pretty quickly. I assumed you were still going to fight him before the Comet. No one told me you decided to wait. Mm, should have just said it, though. This is really, really bad. I love this. It feels so much more serious. We're serious. We've done the wacky stuff. It feels well balanced. It's great. We all fight the Fire Lord together. We got a shot at taking him down. Yes, Team Avatar, not just one. Team Avatar is back. Yes. Air. Water. Earth, fire, man and sword. <laughs> yes, you're just as important. This feels hopeful. It feels optimistic. I love this. Zuko, get in the hug. Get over here, Zuko. Be part of it. Being part of the group also means being part of group hug. Yes. Don't, don't need to up the hug. Yeah, okay, no, there's more to the hug. Amazing, great. There's one technique you need to know before facing my father. How to redirect lightning. Oh, and the smile. Don't I feel this dangerous. <laughs> Smiling for eating the best thing. Thing will follow it. You turn your opponent's energy against them. Is he the best teacher for this? He doesn't even, like, it's redirecting. He can redirect it, but it's like, it's, mm. Against my father. What did it feel like? Exhilarating. I love this team so much. The blue, it looks so cool. Terrifying. Yes, be terrified of it. But you know if you make the wrong move, it's over. Mm-hmm. Hell, not over, over. I mean, there's always Katara and a little spirit water action. She has that still? Used it all up after Azula shot you. Okay, yeah, no more second chances now. This is it. To take the Fire Lord's life before he takes yours. Okay, going back here. Finally, is he thinking about this? I'll just do that. He's not. He can't. He can't. Uh, what can Aang do? How can he, like, process this? Better to take out the Fire Lord. Or, in this case, the Melon Lord. Melon Lord? <laughs> and while the Melon Lord is distracted, Aang swoops in and BAM! He delivers the final blow. So just forgetting that he has a whole army. What about me? For now, you're the Melon Lord's forces. So I get oh. to chuck flaming rocks at all? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever makes the training feel more realistic. Sweetness. This is gonna be... Oh no, this is gonna be a disaster. <laughs> Oh no, she's gonna take this way too far. Can these guys even beat Toph? I'm not sure. It's definitely a good challenge. Seems about right power-wise. And she's made soldiers. I love her so much. Okay, nice, nice. And there's the flaming rocks. Yeah, she is not holding back. Watch it, Toph. <laughs> I am not Toph. I am. I'm so glad she's on their side. I'm so oh, she yeah, she's definitely fallen into this world perfectly. But if she was against them, they would not stand a chance. This isn't even metal bending or sand bending. This is just fell on earth bending. Really you can't take down a melon? What are you waiting for? Take him out! I can't. Yeah, great. Hmm. If this was the real deal, you'd be shot full of lightning right now. Yeah. I didn't feel like myself. There. Ooh. That's how it's done. Oh, I loved that. Actually showing like the... Because uh, we're seeing it from the perspective of Aang. We don't... We can feel and understand why he doesn't want to do it. But then just showing Sokka do it so coldly and brutally, that felt awesome. I have a surprise for everyone. I knew it. You did have a secret thing with Haru. 
Pokemon. <laughs> Look at baby Zuko. Ah. That's not me. It's my father. Great. But he That's looks so great. sweet and innocent. Oh, we're doing this debate. Sweet little kid grew up to be a monster and the worst father in the history of fathers. Yeah, everyone starts out innocent children, but they turn they can turn evil. And the world would probably be better off without it. There's gotta be another way. Like what? You gotta think of it fast then if there is. You can show him his baby pictures and all those happy memories will make him good again. <laughs> Do you really think that would work? Oh Ang. No! I love the optimism, but come on, Ang, come on. You, do you have time to think of a third option? You can't just go around wiping out people I don't like. Sure you can. You're the avatar. And it's not that you don't like, it's the, what's bad for the balance. We're trying to help. Then wouldn't you figure out a way for me to beat the Fire Lord oh, without wow. taking his life? I'd love to hear it. Oh, he's actually gotten a lot more strained and angry. I love this. It's this it's, he's conflicted between the, his monkhood because he is the last of the air nomads. It's not like he can just give it all up. He is the last living piece of his old culture. To go and kill someone would destroy that. So I love how conflicted he is with it. Does he choose being the avatar and getting rid of this person that would destroy the balance of everything? Or does he stay true to his culture? Personally, it feels like the right thing to do. I mean, yes, the culture is important, but the world versus the culture, it's very hard personally for Aang, but the right thing to do would be to kill Ozai, unless you can somehow think of another way to stop him. As long as Ozai is, Ozai is alive, he'll probably still pose a threat. Is that there before? Island? The music is really weird. And you're just, what? You're just going? What's happening? What's happening? He's awake? What the? Just walking out into the ocean? I'm really confused. Is he what? Is he there? Is it what? hypnotism? Like I don't know. Is it, that didn't seem like Ang? He wasn't like talking or expressions or anything. He was just walking and like no emotion. And they left the staff as well. Yeah, it's not Ang. Something else is going on. Ang's not in the house. Let's check the beach. You'd never leave his staff. The thing is gone. Where'd it go? There's his footprints. The trail ends here. He just walks out of the ocean. He went for a midnight swim and never came back? Maybe he was captured. I'm surprised their thoughts aren't going to a darker place. Just going out into the ocean in the middle of the night and then just not coming back. That seems like very deadly. He's definitely on a spirit world journey. But if he Ooh. was, wouldn't his body still be here? Ah, okay, so never mind. Let's split up and look for him. Let's just wait. I'm going with Zuko. Everyone else went on a life-changing field trip with Zuko. Look at him blushing. Now it's my turn. Yay! <laughs> oh, I love that they're using that term. Yeah, Top's finally getting a little moment with him. Cool. Is it? No, he went to an island. This ain't him. Avatar's date! You did it! Oh, it's just the actors. <laughs> but they never gave me the one thing that I really wanted. Their love. I know you had a rough childhood, but we should really focus on finding A. I mean, these two are quite similar. That's just kind of mean. This is the worst field trip ever. Oh. No, I want Toph to have a moment, never develop a bit, get the whole parent thing, you're quite similar. You got everything you wanted, you never, yeah, you, Zuko, rich, Toph, rich, got everything they wanted, but they never got love from their parents, it's quite similar. Bond. Has anyone noticed that Momo's missing too? I knew it was only a matter of time. And what? No. Appa No! <laughs> He's probably with Aang. Yeah. <laughs> That's just what Appa wants you to Why do you think Appa's evil? Get out of the bike's mouth, Sokka. <laughs> we have a real problem here. Aang is nowhere to be found, and the comet is only two days away. No, oh, I don't like the number getting smaller. <laughs> Sliding out. <laughs> Why are you all looking at me? Well, you are kind of the expert on tracking- I'm really just looking at Sokka in the background and whatever it is he's doing. Experience hunting the Avatar? <laughs> <It's> <laughs> but yes, good point. Have Zuko hunt the Avatar. He has experience. Great. Perfect person to do it. Earth Kingdom. There's no way Aang's there. Just trust me. Earth Kingdom? So, okay, no, he's just going in a completely different way. Uh, I guess... Is it on an island that's somehow moving? So that could just end up anywhere. She looks so miserable. Is this because of Mentelli? Okay, no, she just wants to torture people. Great. What's going on with Azula's mind? May and Talia have left her. She lost. I'm going to choose a loss against Zuko and the Avatar gang at the other uh, air temple because she didn't win. What is going on with her? Your costume does look really sick. Sorry I'm late, father. Good palanquin bearers are so hard to come by these days. You're late? Is everything ready for our departure? There has been a change of plans, Azula. What? The expressions on her face keep changing. Passing say alone. 
You will remain here. Oh. No. But I thought we were going to do this together. She looks so hurt. You can't treat me like this. You can't treat me like Zuko. Oh. Silence yourself. But it was my idea to. She's actually, she's actually like talking back to her father. Aside. Azula. No, okay, no, shut down. I need you here to watch over the homeland. It's a very important job that I can only entrust to you. No, that's just getting rid of her. That's what they always say when they want to get rid of someone. To declare you the new Fire Lord. Oh, uh, what? No. Fire Lord Azula does seem appropriate. Okay, what? Just as the world will be reborn in fire. Oh, wow, he re I shall be reborn as the supreme ruler of the world. The costume just keeps getting cooler. I will be known as... The Phoenix King. The oh dear, this guy has a huge ego. Rebirth and okay, wow, they did this fast. They even got new flags and everything. This looks so insane. I love this so much. But okay, yeah, Azula now Fire Lord and Ozai is. I mean, technically Ozai's position isn't real because he. I mean, technically won war but not completely. Yeah, I mean, it's just made up. I guess. So actually, Azula is the Fire Lord? That is interesting. That does seem like more trust and probably a reward rather than just keeping her home. But then would the position become... Oh! Uh, oh Bringing her back? No, she has this giant mole creature. She rides around. It is cool seeing you, I will say that. The only animal that can track any scent anywhere in the world. Oh, Zuko, you genius. Well done. Okay, awesome. We are back to Azula. So Azula... Okay, no, I can't... No. Okay, I love getting just more scenes. Okay, we're actually bringing you back and you've got an awesome scene. Amazing. I don't know who this June lady is, but I like her. Awesome. Because yeah, you never met. I just had the strangest dream. Okay, no, it was hypnotism. Yeah, it's not a dream. You're on a weird floating island. Is this spirit stuff? I feel like it kind might be. Can you have... We've seen... Have we seen spirits in the physical world? Hey, Bai came into the physical world. So maybe this could be something like that? She helped you attack us. Yep. Back in the good old days. Ah, oh, reminiscing. I see you worked things out with your girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> I need your help finding the Avatar. <laughs> Again. Doesn't sound too fun. The end of the world sound like more fun? Cause she'd be in danger too, right? Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, they're friends now. Still remember Appa's fight scene with that thing. It was so awesome. <laughs> Going, whoa, found it. So this thing can just track anyone across the entire world then. Cause at least the last time they were on the same continent, country. Guess not. It means your friend's gone. We know he's gone. No, That's why we're trying to... Gone as in a different time of gone. No, I mean, he's gone, gone. He doesn't exist. Oh, no, that's not... Okay, what? Not the smell of death, but like, it actually just that, have that work. And you'll... Oh, it sounds like she said that before. Maybe I'm in the spirit world? But wait, you can see me. Momo's here. Not spirit world, you can airbend. Still for your world, just on a moving island. You know, dead? Nope. We could find him if he were dead. Wow. It's a real head scratcher. See ya. <laughs> it's okay, so no, you don't know the answer, but for somehow it's just so cavalier to you. There's only one other person in this world who can help us face the Fire Lord. Who? I'll be right back. Who? What? It's say who? That's disgusting. You saved your uncle's sweaty sand. Iro! Yes! Find Iro! Please! You don't like this, man? Let's do this. Okay, they're gonna go find Iro. I love that Zuko kept his sandal. Oh. There's a whole traveling montage, amazing. Ba Sing Say, Great Wall, why is Iro here? Your uncle's somewhere beyond the wall. Nile is getting twitchy, so he can't be too far. Good luck. That's interesting. Why is Iro a Ba Sing Say? He got very far then from going to Fire Nation to here. Okay, this place is getting so weird. It doesn't seem like normal rock. So what rock is it? Huh? It's not made of earth. This is so strange. What is it? I wish I had Roku. I do have Roku. Yes. Want to see the uh, 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 Roku again? Yes, call them on command, please. Come on, where is he? Where is he? All their experience and wisdom is available to you. Amazing. So where am I, Roku? What is this place? I don't know. Great, so all that wisdom, <laughs> nothing. I see that you are lost in more ways than one right now. Ask about the other stuff. I need to figure out what to do once I face the Fire Lord. I feel like Roku wouldn't have an issue with it though. He wanted to kill Sozin when he had the chance and wished he did it, so hmm. Oh, what fire? Oh? Soccer's master! 
John, 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 Paco, Boomy, you're free. Okay, load of old people. I tried to be disciplined and show restraint. Yes. But it backfired. There we go, he's not gonna be on board. If I had been more decisive and acted sooner, I could have stopped Sozin. There we go, yeah. Yeah, he's fully on board with killing him, so. You must be decisive. Decisive. That's okay, that's not exactly saying kill Ozai, that's just be decisive. In the moment, you gotta make the decision. It is respectful to bow to an old master. Awesome. But how about a hug for your new grandfather? Oh! I made her a new betrothal necklace and everything. Welcome to the family, Grand Grand. Oh dear. No, he definitely likes Katawa more. How about Grandpaku? No, he definitely likes Katawa more. How do you all know each other? All old people know each other. <laughs> We're all part of the same ancient secret society, a group that trends- The White Lotus. So this is what that is? A call went out that we were needed for something important. It came from a Grand Lotus, your uncle. I will. He's a Grand Lotus fan. Then we'll take you to him. Wait, someone's missing from your- Someone finally mentioned it. Very important. Where's Momo? Of course. <laughs> He's gone. Ang? And so is Aang. Oh well, so long <laughs> as they have each other, I'm sure we have nothing. Okay, great. Love you, Boomy. Don't change. <laughs> it just jumps away. How did he escape? I don't think they talked about that. Did they talk about that? What happened to um Omashu? I, last time checked, he was locked up in metal. And he was like waiting for the right moment. In my day. Okay, straight with the Kyoshi. I threatened to throw the world out of balance. Yeah, oh yeah, she just killed this guy. I stopped him. Did she mean to? He, it was kind of his own fault. He was too stubborn to get out of the way. Yeah. Personally, I don't really see the difference. Oh. But I assure you, I would have done whatever it took to stop okay, that. Okay, there Because basically Ozai's in the same position. He's being too stubborn to get out, out of the way of Aang restoring balance. So in this scenario, Aang would have to do the same thing. You I shouldn't have asked Kiyoshi. <laughs> you do not like her, okay. Anyone else you can check? I know there was a water one and then what did, the water one, he was the one with Ko, face dealer. And then I've been told that there's another air one before that one who was in like, what is, she had a scene ages ago where she got to see like super powerful airbending. What or when? But I knew I'd know it when I knew it. Okay, answers. An eclipse, that'll do it. This how you get out? Okay, I'm not sure who's more powerful since he, with, between him and Toph, because he can do that and he doesn't even have to touch the ground. Can Toph do that? <laughs> so they just never were taught about this. You've got no firepower. Awesome. And it's payback time. Can he do this in eight minutes though? They probably can. I love this joy on his face. Ew. Is he just reorganizing the entire thing? He's why you're launching buildings! Okay, is he the strongest earthbender? I think Toph probably takes the cape from just metal bending, sand bending, and all the versatility that comes with it and just how she sees things. <laughs> I, I, Toph has competition. Okay, actually seeing him struggle. Awesome. I hope this didn't hit anyone. I feel like this could have killed people. Did you do that in eight minutes? I love you so much, Boomy. You're amazing. What about you guys? Did you do anything? Wait, Toph can actually meet Boomy. Can you two talk? No, nah. no, not really. <laughs> I need to look deep inside myself. Water bender, air one, older. Water. I am Avatar Korok. Korok. I was always a go with the flow kind of avatar. Actually, didn't see another avatar. This is so cool. People seem to work out their own problems. And there was peace and good times. Seems like how Water Avatar would do it. I lost the woman I loved to code. The face stealer. Awesome seeing that horrifying thing again. If I had been more attentive and more active, I could have saved her. Hmm. I don't know if it's getting lost in what you didn't do or just their regrets, because you are talking to dead people. Because it's their regrets. What if it's still difficult because they're seeing it through what they could have done differently. They're looking at their failures and what they could. Is there one that actually just full on started killing people to get things done? Or is there one that actually found a solution to this problem? You've got a bunch in there. Where is he? Your uncle's in there, Prince Zuko. Come on, okay, we're so close. Oh, he looks so, he almost, he looks so sad. I don't know if I'm afraid. 
Oh, yeah, I love this. Oh, sitting outside. Are you okay? No, I'm not okay. My uncle hates me. I know it. Oh, no, he does not. He'd be so proud of where you are now. More sorry than I've been about anything in my entire life. Then he'll forgive you. Come on, please. He will. Get in the door. Go to the tent, please. I love how much emphasis they're putting on the struggle this reunion is. They feel slow, like the breathing, the emphasis is amazing. Don't tell me he's asleep. You've gotta be kidding, he's asleep? Right now? At least he gives you a bit of time to prepare. Oh, you're just gonna stay by his side. Okay. Oh, they really are dragging that on. I just want them to be reunited and this is it's very close. Maybe an air nomad avatar will understand where I'm coming from. Okay. You can't really talk. Pretending you can just helps me think. I'm sure he understands. I am Avatar Yang Chen, young heir. Yang Chen. The monks always taught me that all life is sacred, even the life of the tiniest spider fly. This would be a better insight with the whole culture thing. All life is sacred. Okay, some agreement. And I've only had to use violence for necessary defense. And I've certainly never used it to take a life. Nah, 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 there was a vulture thing in the desert. I remember that. This is about the world. But the monks mm. taught me that I had to detach myself from the world so my spirit could be free. That's the monks' way, is that? Air nomads have detached themselves and achieved spiritual enlightenment. Yeah, not monks. But the avatar though. can never do it. Mm. Because your sole duty <sighs> is to the world. Air Nation with the avatars are the got to be one of the most interesting. Sacrifice your own spiritual needs and do whatever it takes. To protect the world. Okay, so actually being the avatar is in direct conflict with the air nomad culture. That is insane. I have to kill the Fire Lord. It's, I mean, he's never gonna be okay with it, but at least he's open to it now. But wow. This makes it like that avatar, because the avatar could have been any nation, but having it air makes it so much more interesting now that it's in direct conflict. Uncle. Silence. Oh, you must have mixed feelings about seeing me, but I want you to know I am so. So sorry. Love the voice acting. Oh, and he's crying. I don't know how I can ever make it up to you. But I... Ah, <sighs> okay, this is amazing. I love their faces, they are they're animated. I thought you would be furious with me. I was never angry with you. Oh. I was sad because I was afraid you lost your way. Oh, but he found it back. He found his way back. And you did it by yourself. Yes. I want to cry. This is amazing. You have a pretty strong scent. <laughs> oh, that's everything I wanted. I don't care how this final ends up. That was amazing. Oh. Mm. Sounds? Is it just me? Or are those mountains getting bigger? He doesn't even know that the island's moving. He just woke up on the forest. They're not getting larger. They're getting closer. Okay, at least you're getting some understanding of this place now. Yep, yeah, underneath of it. Great. It's not attached to anything. A claw? What is this thing? Is this alive? It's amazing, Momo. The biggest animal in the world. You know what? I've got to swim around and find its face. You're acting like you know what this is. Biggest animal in the world? What is that? Okay, so this is an animal. They are great. You're the only person other than the Avatar who can possibly defeat the Father Lord. You mean the Fire Lord. Yeah, that sounded weird. Father Lord. <laughs> no, Zuko. It won't turn out well. Brother versus brother. Even if I did defeat Ozai, and I don't know that I could. Good, love the humility. History would see it as just more senseless violence. Finish versus finish. Yeah. Killing a brother to grab power. Yeah. The only way for this war to end peacefully is for the Avatar. The one to bring balance to it is his destiny. He can't, yeah. Then would you come and take your rightful place on the throne? No, someone new must take the throne. Yes, it's from the past. Realist with a pure heart and unquestionable honor. Oh. Unquestionable honor? You have unquestionable honor. I've made so many mistakes. That's what led you to it. You restored your own honor, and only you can restore the honor of the Fire Nation. You'd be Oh, it's brilliant. The Fire Nation has lost its honor, Zuko lost his honor, and he reclaimed it in the best way possible. He can, he can make a fire, it'll be an amazing Fire Lord, and he would actually fix the Fire Nation. This is so poetic. I had a vision that I would one day take Ba Sing Se. A vision? Spirit stuff. My destiny is to take it back from the Fire Nation. Oh, oh Ivo, you keep getting better. You must return to the Fire Nation so that when the Fire Lord falls, you can assume the throne. Ah, uh, there's someone currently there. Azula will be there mm. waiting for you. Yeah, okay, it's, it's like the, it's, yeah, it's gonna be the final of the, um, the play, it's gonna line up. How would you like to help me put Azula in her place? It would be my pleasure. That definitely doesn't help with like the shippers, does it? Have him choosing Katara to go with him. We need to do everything we can to stop the airship fleet. Yeah. And that means when Aang does face the 
Fire Lord, we'll be right there if he needs us. Amazing. I love this, they're planning. I, I love how much attention it is not, we haven't had a load of action. They've actually- Drew over land or swims quicker than a giant eel hound. Eel hound, great. Yeah, I love that, what this has done. It's not just action, it's building up, it's preparing, and it feels amazing. This is what, they, yeah, this is for kind of, this feels like the full on final. We had the invasion where that was basically a whole lot of action. Now we actually got full on planning. It feels a bit more messy, but like, it feels right because they don't have ages to prepare. They have got like a couple days. This is like one day before the comet now. And I just love how it feels so impromptu and how they're making the final feel so um, just good. It's like the final thing they have to do. They can't prepare, it's the final moment. They have to do it. Today, destiny is our friend. I love this so much, I love this so much. Everyone's on the same team. We've got the reunion, it's amazing. Boomy's back and it's just amazing. And Ang is just on and up floating animal. How's he swimming faster than it? Water bending. Yeah, water bending. Eyes. It's massive. Oh, the foot! Oh, the water pressure. That, oh, I would hate that. I'm just being forced out of the water that quickly. It's holding him weirdly. It's holding him like he knows what it's doing. A lion turtle. Lion turtle? The shell, the hexagon, it's a shell! Even my own past lives. It has tattoos. Are expecting me to end someone's life. It has a human face. I don't know if I can do it. True mind can weather all the lies and- What this, what is this thing? The true heart can tough the poison of hatred without being hard. Let's bring a giant magical turtle out of nowhere. It always yields to purify light. What is happening? What is this? Wait for him. What is happening right now? I'm so confused. Green lights, talking giant turtle. And for a new world to be born from the ashes. Of course, the dude gets an awesome looking air warship. It looks like, I'm, I, I was I awful person, but he looks incredible. The comet's turning the sky red or orange. It's here. And stop there, that's incredible. Part two will be up now, but I need to separate them just so I can include more footage because this was insane. Yeah, amazing start to the final, just building it up and now it feels like it's gonna go in somewhere. Absolutely incredible and I cannot wait to see it. And this is, I know, watching the next two episodes will be insane, but then I'll get close to the end. I'm, nah. Fire turtle, gonna need time, not fire turtle, the weird lion turtle, that's gonna need time to process whatever that thing was. I'm gonna need answers on that thing. But yeah, Zuko and I was reunion, that definitely makes up for the confusion. But yeah, I will see you in the next episodes.